Welcome to the Irving Art Center and this week's Gallery Spotlight. And join us every Thursday for a new spotlight on a different piece of art. My name is Bobby and I'm a docent for the Irving Art Center. Today we'll be looking at a piece of art, Rusted Vehicle Number 14, in the Signs, Symbols, and Services exhibit of photographs by artist Lee Saludos. Rusted Vehicle 14 is a photograph taken in 19, excuse me, in 2017 in Diamond Valley, Nevada. This rusty corrosive surface is very interesting to me. Rust is formed by the reaction of iron and oxygen in the presence of water, which forms iron oxide. As with Mr. Salutis's other photos, you cannot tell what the object really is unless you read the title. I also wonder what the original color of this car or truck was before it started rusting. Is it blue? Is it white? The unusual pattern of circles or spots is what drew me to this photograph. It invited me to use my imagination in looking to see what I could find in the photo. It made me wonder how rust could occur in such a perfect shape. Did water drip into the surface? How long did it take to rust? With a degree in microbiology, these red spots reminded me of plates of bacteria that we used to grow on auger in an incubator. The red bacteria are often serratia marcescens, which causes the harmless red ring in your toilet. I can also visualize a fire-breathing dragon blowing fireballs and wondering how big those circles actually are. Are they the size of a quarter, a dinner plate, or perhaps even the head of a pin? The artist says he didn't do much digital manipulation on the images, but did he blow up a small area to print in this photograph? The red circles also look like how COVID-19 virus might look when expelled from the lungs of someone coughing or breathing. You can see the core of the virus and its spikes. Mr. Salutis was inspired by many artists such as Jackson Pollock who liked to splash or spatter paint onto canvases. And this piece definitely looks as though it could have been painted instead of photographed. The blue and white background definitely looks like it could have been painted and the spots of red and rust splattered on top of it after it, after it um, was painted. I can also imagine that this is an aerial photograph of the Mediterranean Sea, specifically the area between North Africa and the tip of Italy's boot, and the spheres are actually a UFO invasion of planet Earth. The blues are varying ocean depths and islands, and the continent is white. Imagine the spots are many suns or stars with solar flares emanating from the solar surface against the backdrop of outer space. But of course, stars would never be so near each other. What do you see? Can you see something different? What if you turn your head to look at the image? Do, you, do any of these colors evoke a feeling or response from you? Do you think that as rust, something we view as ugly or decaying could actually be art? Remember to join us this week and every Thursday for a new gallery spotlight and also to, to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.